Hey folks, it's Frithgar here, how you doing? Welcome back to Farming Simulator 19 here in Erlingrat. Uh, what else? We've got another harvest job there, this field 9. Um, several harvest jobs here to go and do now. We've got a cotton one there. I'm not going to do cotton on this series. I'm not going to do any cotton jobs on this series. I've got a weeding job right there in field 3. Right, let's start getting some of these jobs underway, shall we? We will start getting a few of these things up and running. I'm going to, i tell you what, I'll take that job right now, the field three weeding. I think that is the only weeding job that I've got. The harvest jobs, we'll take a look at those as well, yeah, we're, we're, and we'll get the plowing job. We'll, 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 let's get several of these jobs going, I think. Um, I believe we've got time here in the afternoon. You've still got 30%, so I should have enough time to go to... Wait, what? Oh, no! <laughs> I've done it again! I'm such an idiot. I've done it again. Uh, that one right there, I'm going to need to cancel that contract. Are you sure you want to cancel? Yes. All right, I don't get a reimbursement. I don't have to pay anything on it, fortunately. I go collect on there. Um, let me refresh the contracts and see if it brings the Field 3 one back or not. Uh, oh, it does. It brings it back. Oh, that's brilliant. Right. I don't want to accept the contract. I want to borrow the items. Right? That was an administrative error. I didn't mean to do that. Ooh, because it refreshed contracts, it gave us a faster tractor to get up to the field with. That I'm not going to complain about. That I'm rather happy about. Okay, we will go with that. We'll go with the faster tractor. And uh, we'll take this one. And we'll run up and we can start weeding at field three. As soon as I've got that one up and running, we're going to get the plowing jobs going. We're going to get the cultivation jobs going. Uh, there's a whole load of jobs that we will get running. And I kind of figured that if we can get the plowing and cultivation jobs going to start with, then we will, once those are done, uh, then we can get going on one of the harvest jobs, at least. Maybe a couple of them. I'm thinking we do one at a time. Um... Field 19 right next to us right here I, is, is kind of the one that I'm leaning towards because we don't have very far to go in order to get to it. However, that one is giving us the small trailed harvester rather than a bigger self-propelled harvester. And that's why I'm also wanting to lean away from it. Because those uh, trailed harvesters, everything takes a ridiculously long time. At least we don't, well, I don't think we have to run alongside it. I will double check machine. If it's one that you've got to constantly run alongside, definitely not doing it. I, I'm, I'm not getting involved with that. Um, but if it does have an onboard capacity at least, then, you know, we, we can give it a go. And the, the harvester can w run itself up and down the fields and we can go along afterwards and, like, help out. So field three right here. What I'm going to do is a pass along this bottom end. A pass along the far side and a pass along that top end and then I'll leave the field go. Oh, I'll tell you what. We might be able to have the hired help do this. We go in here and let me just put that one up to 100% turn. I don't know if that makes any difference or not, to be honest. Um, I just generally put it on. Right, if I put you on there, you have got, yeah, that's the, the settings that I like to have. Yeah, I can leave that one going just like that. I don't need to do anything else to it. Excellent. Right. You can go just like that. Uh, you are close to being empty, although the truck is all the way down over there. Uh, so I'll come back to you in a minute. I'm not going to be able to. You're going to run out be probably before you get to the end of the row here, aren't you? All right. We will stick with this one. I don't really want to be driving the pickup truck up and down the field too much if I can help it. Just because, you know, it's, it's going to bounce it around and, and mess up the suspension. It's better to leave it parked, take the tractor over to there and reload it. This is just an easier way to do it. Uh, 
this one. I think we'll run it to the end of the row, and then I'll stop, and I'll drive down. Yeah, we'll, we'll do that, because it's, it's not going to go very far anyway. Uh, let's bring you up to there, like that, and then... We'll drive on down to the other end of the field. Now, what I am going to do when I start up again is I'm going to start on that side of the field. I'm going to work back towards the middle of the field just because it's going to end up making it a little bit easier. Helper D is blocked by an object. That will be our rake up there. He's gone to the end of the field. He's gotten stuck against the fence. That's what he's gone and done, I'll bet. Well, that's fine. We'll deal with that in a minute. Right. I want to load this one up here. With as much seed as we can get on board. So there's one right there. So you're going to go for full, there's a, a full pallet right there. And another full pallet he's taking right there. And then he's going to take... You know, he's filled right up. So I've, I've got... I, I don't know how much I've got left there. It's, it's, no, I've got no real way of knowing how much I've got left there. We'll start out on this side over here run you out just onto the edge like that now it's overlapping a little bit further than it needs to but that should be fine drop you down there and away you go you did you turn just then no that's fine let's just bring you back a little bit start you again right off you go yes off you go and we need to just yeah it did he, he, he went up to this point and then he stopped not quite sure why he went that far but that's what he did so I'll bring you over here like this and start you again AI vehicle extension why are you diving off to the side of the field you shouldn't be doing that so what we'll do instead is we'll bring you like this. And we will try and do this manually, whether that's going to work or not. Right. Not doing it manually. I'm letting the um, AI vehicle extension have a go. But I'm not sure he's going to work properly. I may need to just nurse. Yeah, we'll, we'll we'll watch this one through. I want to get it over to the other side. Uh, like, just uh, do one run along the top and then get over to the other side. And then we can, like, let it go. With the standard hired help, I think, that's probably going to be our best bet. And it can run up and down the field and shouldn't have any problems whatsoever. Uh, got a field. There's ready to harvest. We're not harvesting that field. I'm not getting involved with that one. Go on a bit more. Uh, right, let's turn you off there. Okay, so I'm not going to have the AI extension. It doesn't seem to work very well with this one. I will run this across so that we're not diving off to the off the end of the field when we go through. He comes up to there. I want him to do one pass over to this top corner, and then we can start moving up and down the field that way. And just work our way back across and that'll get the whole field done. It shouldn't actually take very long to do this field either, which is good. Right, so you're underway and you're underway. I've got cultivating on field 8. Where is field 8? It's that one there. Uh, that is... Ooh. Prepare field 8 for the next crop by cultivate. Well, I don't know what that cultivator is. And we've got we got a love uh, okay we we're, we're going to we're definitely going to go with that one. We only get 1200 for it. We don't get a great deal for it. Plowing, plowing. Field 25 is another cultivation job, that one right there. So we're going to borrow those items as well. Okay, you have come out over to this side. So I'm going to bring you around over here and I'm going to set you going up and down the row, the, the rows right there, like that. Perfect. Okay, you go on and do that. We don't need to worry about you anymore. This one is working perfectly in the field there without any issues. There's the train. Right. Your field 25. 
And then that great big long one there, which I'm quite interested to get going with, that's field eight, that one is. It's quite a big machine for what we're doing. There's no front weight been set down for this one at all, so we're just doing it like this. Uh, this one was field 23 up in the top corner, so I want to go around here like this. And up this way. And then... Right, I want to turn right here, and then there's a, a road that heads up the hill in a minute. Yeah. That's where we want to go. So we, we want to go up this way. Yeah, there's the road. I can see a truck going on up it right now. And head over to that one. So I want to be indicating left, right here. One round the roundabout a bit, and uh, now start indicating right, come off the roundabout, and then we go on up the hill, and this is where we've got to be a bit careful that we don't smash into any other traffic, because people tend to get a little bit sour if you sideswipe their cars with a massive great big tractor, or cultivator, you know, either or, um, that they're not too picky about which one they're going to get sour about. Can I get past you? Ooh. Oh, 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 it's a tight squeeze, but he did it. Look at that. It was a tight squeeze, but Fritgar managed to pull it off. Let's get on round here. It's a good job there's nobody coming on the outside round of that bit just then that I went whizzing out. So we've got field 25 right here, just up from this little sh next chicane right here. I get that one going. I'll just put the standard hired help in there. I'm... I'm not actually sure. I've not worked Field 25 yet. What have we got? on the, oh, There's another road up there. It's going to be in the way of us, isn't it? A little bit. Not a huge amount. There's the, the grass field there we did some work in. It looks like, from what people have been saying, that with the Precision Farming DLC, you cannot do grass contracts because the grass fields don't have you putting fertilizer or uh, plowing or anything else on them at all. What you end up with is none of them yield the way they should. Not a single one of them ends up giving you the yield that they should be giving. Uh, I can ignore it on this end. I'm going to run down to this end of the field. And I'm going to do a single pass. I shouldn't need to do any more than that, I don't think. And then for field 25, for us to be able to effectively do it, we want to start on the opposite side to where I am right here. And I, I'm not going to worry about the edge of the field overlap bit. I suppose I should. Um, right, I'll bring you back there. Like that. And right, that's perfect there. We start filling this bit in. Filling in or start like cultivating this piece. And then we come down this side of the field here. And it's this bit right here. Because it's at an angle, it's going to make things a little bit... It shouldn't actually mess up too badly. It should be fine. So I'm hoping it will be. I should have started down that other end. Because there's not actually that much room to turn around down there either. No, actually, uh, we'll, be, we'll be all right. We'll figure this out. We can run... I'll I'll set it. I'll I'll do a pass from here, and then we'll start kind of the the field work, the hired help going on the long side down through, and I think that will work out okay. It'll work out just fine because I can also like I can start the hired help working from this bit. I want to just do a pass along that bottom end there, get it back from the road a bit. Although I mean, looking at it, it's probably going to be let's let's. Oh, no, I don't want AI extension. Hmm. No, I will do I will do a pass across the bottom end of the field there just to make sure that it does work properly. Love the Black Voucher. I've always been a bit of a sucker for the Black Voucher. There was a Black Massey, I think, in FS17, and that looked absolutely fantastic. Just wetting my whistle a little bit. Pull you up through there and then yeah we'll do one pass along this bottom end just to make it nice and clean here I'll just drop you in there like that haul you on around the corner 
There. Perfect. Right. So you can just be left to carry on here. We'll go and check on our other two drivers and make sure that they're doing okay. And then we will get the other cultivating job set up over on field eight and get that one underway. Uh, we've got three plowing, four plowing jobs, I think it is, that we want to get going. Um, I'm kind of thinking that with the plowing jobs, I might just set... Oop, no. Uh, I'm going to go like that. I'm going to go like that. I might just set them going um, and then go and tidy up the edges after the plowing is finished. Kind of thinking that might be a better way to do it for those. It's just going to allow us to get through them a little bit quicker. Right, you are doing just fine up here. No problem. You're doing fine here. You've still got just under half of your planter, which means time you get back through, even if we've only got like one and a half thousand liters of potatoes left on that trailer over there, we should have just enough to finish this field. At least that's what I'm hoping. So you can be well underway with that. Uh, yeah, you're doing fine. So it's you that we want next. Great big job, this one. Look at that cultivator. That is a beast of a cultivator, that is. Now, i got to actually get the thing hooked on. And that is not going to be the easiest thing, considering where... No, oh, actually, there. I didn't... I, I did wonder if it would not, like, properly hook on there. But it has hooked on. Now, this one takes seed. And I am wondering if that is going to cause us some problems. Right, that car there is definitely going to cause us problems. Unfortunately, this vehicle is not one that is going to be very easy to do any reversing with. And I suspect that the hired help is not going to want to do any reversing with it either. Which... In turn, I suspect means it's going to be rather tricky doing anything with it in the field. Like uh, manoeuvring, turning around uh, on the headlands, getting it lined up. All, all the rest of the little tips and tricks that we would normally want to employ are going to be a little tiny bit of a struggle. So, we'll see is all we can say on this one at the moment. It's just a we will see. See how it pans out for us. Able to drive along. I tell you what, if I wasn't using my steering wheel at the moment, and if I was doing the keyboard steering, I would genuinely be struggling to do this, because these things are... They're difficult enough to control when you've got a steering wheel. Trying to do it with keyboard steering is just really, really hard work. I have tried to do it before. I just find it horribly hard work. I really struggle with it. So why is field 10 over here being offered with a uh, a non-trail, with a self-propelled harvester? Whereas the field 19, I think it is, the one that's next to the dealership, that one has got a trailed harvester for it. It's, it, it doesn't kind of make sense. They're both about the same size. I mean, yeah, I, I get that, you know, some farmers wouldn't necessarily have the big expensive gear, but usually the game doesn't sort of view it like that. The game just kind of views it on the size of the field rather than anything else. And, like, the the field over next to the dealership is still plenty big enough. I would have thought that it would warrant one. Anyway, what do we know? Um, let's go on in here. So now, this cultivator that we've got does also sow seeds. I'm hoping the hired help doesn't require seeds in it in order for it to be able to run. That's my concern on this. Now, I've never used this one before, so I don't know what it's like. I'll unfold it a minute. So that extends back in a straight line like that. It goes like that. So which bit cultivates? Drop you down there. Does the back bit cultivate as well? Okay, the back bit doesn't cultivate. I lift you up. But it also, it doesn't twist as much as I thought it might. Oh, it no, it, it, it still twists and turns a bit. Just maybe not quite as much as I th thought it would. 
I don't know. It's it's going to be difficult to do this one. I think we're going to need to do like four or five passes on the edge of the field here in order to have enough room for this thing to turn round. I mean, don't get me wrong. I, I quite like that we've got this thing here. It's, it's something new that we're using that we've not used before, and I always like that. Okay, we turn it right. It, it does have plenty of twisty power on it. That's the official term, is twisty power. So all i got to do is be able to reverse it in order to properly line everything up. I can do that. There. Right, and then we can bring you in on this side right here. Lower you down again. And I'll do another pass. And I'll do one more, I think, after this. He's trying to line up behind the tractor quite quickly. Right? It seems to be drifting sideways in order to line up behind the tractor. I don't know if that's an intentional thing or what. Are you like... Yes, he's, he's definitely sliding sideways in order to try and line up behind the tractor here. Which is not what I was expecting. Don't know if that's an intentional design or what. Definitely, right, we, we can't turn too sharp. We do have to remember that the stuff behind us isn't on caterpillar tracks like we are. So let's reverse up here. Back you like that. Yeah, I know I'm driving onto the neighbor's field. I think I'm doing well just to be reversing this thing, so don't judge me for driving on the neighbor's field. We just pretend that bit didn't happen. Just, just, yeah, we'll, 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 ju we'll just imagine that we didn't actually do that. And, uh, or if we did, the neighbor was fine with it. Or he just didn't ever know that it happened and therefore he couldn't say anything. Um, there's a thousand and one options that could cover up our little sins right there. It'll, it'll be our secret. We won't tell anyone. It'll just be between me and, you know, everybody watching. So just, 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 just don't tell anybody. Don't, and for whatever you do, don't tell Sen. Let's, let's just leave it at that, yeah? Don't tell Sen. Um, now, if I can bring you over, I'm going to have to do the same down the other end. But what I'm thinking, helper F has stopped work unexpectedly. This tank is empty. What I was thinking here is if I can get a pass down this side, it might make life a little tiny bit easier for doing this same job that we've been doing here down the other end. Uh, I'm oh no, not AI extension. I definitely don't want that here. I want to go like that, and I want to just engage the hired help like that. Very quickly straightens up behind my tractor. And I'm going to leave that one to run down through there a second while we go and put a bit more seed into the uh, the Valtra so that we can just finish off that job there. But look at this cultivator. That is absolutely beautiful right there, is it not? Is that not absolutely wonderful, that machine there? Yeah, I love that. Never used this one before. It's... I don't know, I... Something of this length and that, you'd, you'd kind of expect it to be a bit wider than this, to be honest. But there we go. That's, that's the way of it. Right, I'll let that one carry on a minute. You're nearly done. You over here, you need more seed. Right, let's go and do that next. Are you going to have enough seed with those three pallets? I think it's two part pallets and one full pallet. Is it going to be enough to finish the field? That's the big question. We had ten pallets of seed that we had out of all of this. Is this going to be enough? So we want to start filling one up. We've got 500 litres in there. Even less in there. So that gives us eight... Uh, this one will be full. So that's 1,800 litres. 67%. Now I had a full one there for that last bit. I don't think I've got enough. I mean, maybe, maybe we've got enough. I'm not sure. This this is going to be a bit touch and go. We, we may have to get one more pallet here. We, I don't think we're going to need any more than one more pallet. I think one would be the absolute maximum that we would need. But we'll, we'll let it go. We'll let that one carry on doing what it's doing. And we're going back over here. Good gravy, you're almost finished. Ideal. 
I don't mind that. And then you down here. Right, he's able to turn there without any problem. He is leaving a little bit. And then there was a bit of a mess down the other end. And I'm kind of thinking we'll just leave this one to carry on doing what it's doing. Because otherwise we could be here for a very long time. Trying to make sure that that one is doing everything perfectly. So we'll go straight to field 11. Doing some plowing in that one. So I'm going to borrow items for that contract. Field 11 is that one right there. Contract on field 25 is finished. You here. But I'm... The job itself isn't finished. The hired help hasn't finished. That would be... Well, I got two. We, well, field 25 is the cultivating. And then we've also got the weed... The, the weeding that's going on on field 3. That one's close to finishing as well. So we've got a nice big Massey. And we've got the Lemkin Titan. It's a beautiful plow. Lovely big beastie. I'm sort of thinking that maybe we should get this uh, job going here in this field, this harvest job right here. Because um, I don't know how long it's going to take for each tank to fill up on the harvest machine. Uh, this one, it's not the one here. It's the one over next to field 12 that we're working on. We want field 11, so we want to travel on down the road a little bit. Then we'll take a look at a harvest job, and we can put more plowing jobs going, working around the harvest job. I think that might be a better way of doing this, because some of these jobs, they look like they are going to be completed in a fairly timely fashion, which is... Oh, and that's a good thing. That means that we're getting through several more of them. Um... But we're sort of also, we could contract on field three is finished. We're coming back to that bit about do we limit ourselves to the number of jobs that we can take every day? Should I only have a set number of jobs that I'm allowed to take? Or should I just have myself being able to take as many jobs as I want? Right, you in here, I definitely don't want the AI extension on this job. I want to unfold the plow and... I want to rotate that one over for this run down through here. I'm going to use the hired help to do the pass across the field. I'm going to do that. Right. Uh, help A has completed their task. So we've got one job has now finished already. I'll bring you... Where are you going to be? You're going to sort of come back that way a little bit. I would say something... Something like that. Let's go for helper H to stop work unexpectedly. Field not own. Uh, I know why it's saying field not owns because the plow is sticking so far out over the edge. That's why. Oh wait, there is one more thing that I want to do. This plow. This plow is adjustable. I forgot about that bit. Right. Let me bring that over here. The adjustment basically gives you a wider plowing width. And that's a really, really good thing. That means you get through the field so much quicker than you would otherwise. There, we'll set that one going. We've got that on the widest width. And look at that. It's nearly double what it was to start with. And I almost forgot about that little feature with this plow. Which would have been a little bit of a jolly nuisance. So you can just skip down there. You are finished. And you've done a good job as well. I didn't think that it would do the last little bit up in that top corner. But it does appear to have actually completed that properly. We'll just bring you to the very edge of the field right there. Shut you off, and you are done. So that cultivating job is finished. We'll go there. Cultivating on field... Well, unfortunately, folks, that is all we have got time for today. So while I sit up here and enjoy this view and a well-earned break, could you please consider taking a look at the links in the description down below? We have Nitrado, who provide gaming servers, who are very, very reliable, and they provide us with a server on our Discord channel. And there is also Fanatical, where you can buy all kinds of different computer games for various different platforms. 
So if you've enjoyed this video, then please head down below and give us a like. And if you really enjoyed it, then please tell your friends all about me. Get them to come and watch as well. That would be awesome. And until next time, thank you very much for watching. This is Frithgar. Goodbye, and see you later.